Well, today's another birthday day, isn't it, Mo? No, it's my birthday today. It's your birthday? No. Is it Matthew's birthday? No. Is it, is it your birthday? No. So we're having a Bible class. And it is a birthday today, but I'm feeling a bit bad for Mel's mum because I don't think she's having a party, is she? And she's got no cake. A sask. Ma, are you having a birthday party? No? I will get you a cake. Okay? How old? Ma, Ma, how old? 33? Ah? Okay. <laughs> so, go into town and get a birthday cake, eh? For your mum. What does she like? Well, I don't want to get cheap. Just want to get what she wants. <laughs> Ma, what cake do you like? What cake? What cake? <laughs> Three layers. Three layers? I'm talking like you now. <laughs> So you, you can see that me and Ma have a good relationship and she understands nothing I say. <laughs> so how's my little man? Look at that handsome little chap. Ooh, he, he keeps looking up at the ceiling. I mean, it's been a long time since my kids, my kids, they're not kids anymore. It's been years since they were young. I can't remember a baby that's looked up at the ceiling all the time. He looks everywhere but at you. Hey, hey, are your daddy? Can daddy have a smile? Can daddy have a smile? A big smile? He's a big smile. Hey. <laughs> So we're going to get a cake for Grandma, aren't we, baby, eh? You're going to go and get a cake? Yes, Daddy. Well, you're not going to get a cake because it's too hot. Because uh, today there's a little bit of a, a breeze that's uh, taking the heat away. And it's, again, about one of the first days. We had a half day without rain the other day. But it's just raining and raining and raining, like I say. Go figure, it's rainy season. <laughs> so just a normal day at the shop. We've got our Bible class. Oh, we've got some sausage left that I can take some for the dog. So it's a really nice day and we shouldn't complain when it's sunny, I love it when it's hot just check me van I really worry about it being here because in the Philippines I'm afraid nobody takes care there's not much respect of property I mean look at this I don't know where this is blown from where that's come from so you see this shop over the road I've mentioned it before <coughs> but it never seems to have any customers there's never I mean I see the odd ones during the day but they can't be making money hence what I said about I would not recommend a Sari Sari store it's long hours 
uh, not fun, you know, not a lot of reward. So if you're going to do something, you should do food. Food makes a little bit of money. And then you only have to do it at certain times in the morning and in the evening, that's it. So we'll go and get this cake, I think. So, Mel, I've got a, another message, one of many, that says, um, I'm sick in the head. I'm not glad. Well, I can't get a woman in the West, so I come to the Philippines because I'm, I'm mentally retarded or something. I can't get a, a Western woman, so I come for a younger Filipina so I can treat her as a slave and they only marry you because you've got money, but in your case you've got no money because you keep um, asking for money. So. We're nearly having an accident here. So, what do you say to that, Mel? Why would you marry a, a foreign man and say, uh, not an older it's Filipina? Secure. It's secure to marry to a foreign man than to the Filipino man, old man. So, you've done it for security? Yes. Financial security as well? Yes. Yeah. Well, and you then, played a blind of marrying me then, didn't you? Yeah. <laughs> and then... And then... And then looks good for the... Oh yeah, of course yeah. I'm really handsome as well, no. aren't I? No? <laughs> so what do you mean, it looks good? Yeah, you're alright. <laughs> oh, I'm alright? Uh, so even though I'm an old man, I, I still look okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, that's it then. So we're going to treat you to the cake shop. What shop? Yeah. Over there. Wow, what's over there? I will buy um, what's it called? For the spaghetti. Oh, yes, cooking spaghetti. So, yes. we're buying her a cake and you're cooking spaghetti. No. What about the alcohol? No, I'm joking. <laughs> <coughs> There's a lot of alcohol in that shop. Yeah. It's like this in Nagy every day. Really busy. I love it. <laughs> 20 pesos. That's cheap. Now you watch, there'll be error when we do, when I get home and edit this video. Error, no video. Oh, potatoes. I'm gonna do some, I'm gonna buy, mind you, these are new potatoes, aren't they? I'm gonna buy some potatoes and do some proper chips one day. And I say proper chips. Depending on the uh, oil I use, it'll probably not be proper. See this lemon, it's good for high blood pressure. We, uh, we do, ooh, do a couple of glasses of this every day. So there's lots of fresh produce, but what I've what I've noticed, and I've said this on a previous video, the prices are starting to rise. It's, uh, I wouldn't say a lot more, but it's, it's increased considerably since I arrived in the Philippines. But this is what I like as well, look. Instant salad. So if you want a salad. And it is still quite cheap as well. But there's a, the lemons are a must if you've got high blood because it does help. 
Hence my high blood is low blood now. Sorry. Searching for a longer day People feeling like the light has just come We must never stop the way Birds chirping and I hear my name Grass